can do a speed dating type of interview and then you pick a few applicants to get to know a little bit more until you narrow it down. But I heard that those agencies were charging the helpers a lot of money in order to go through this process. Some agencies they are very helpful. They can uh, get us a few helpers to interview during the week, but we always insist that during our rest days we have the chance to really meet the helper face to face. In addition to that, we want the helper to really come to our home to really see the work environment. The thing is, in Hong Kong, there is no probation period for domestic workers. They start the employment and then if something goes bad, you will have to terminate the contract and they don't really have a second chance to find someone as easily because then they have 14 days remaining in Hong Kong before they have to go back to their home country. It puts them in a very difficult situation. When I found out about the fair agencies, I learned that they would go through all the applications for me. They would give me a questionnaire so they could find out what we were looking for, like how many children we have, do we have a dog, then they would present to me three or four helpers. Those helpers had not paid any money to be a part of that process. Skills matching is important because you have to find the right person for your family. Focus on the skills and the needs. Take a bit more time to find someone right before you actually try and then, you know, stop the contract and then try again.